know. Yeah, very, very frustrating, very disappointed. It's um, the start into the game was horrible, absolutely horrible. It was the opposite of what we wanted to do. First 12 minutes, two nil down um, is absolutely, it's never helpful. But especially in our situation, it's absolutely not allowed to happen. Not for being passive, not for doing what we did in these moments. Um, so we saw obviously different games today, all in one. First 12 minutes, then an okay po away performance where yeah, we created, we were there, that was absolutely okay, but then and then we started extremely well in the second half, that's the, 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 the next, I don't know exactly, 25, 30 minutes in the second half or the first of them. Uh, it was brilliant, it was a super away game without scoring. Um, yeah, and then they scored the, the third goal from a counter-attack and the rest is then getting it over the line pretty much. Um, yeah, we all caused, we caused that misery uh, with the first 12 minutes. And you can ask me if I can explain it. I can, it's now 10, 15 minutes after the game, still not. It's not, that is not, cannot happen. It cannot, did, I know. But um, that's really tough to swallow. I was going to say, just that has been a theme throughout the season, starting so slowly. It, do you, it, I know you said you can't explain it, but is it is it a men, do you think it is a mentality thing? Is it does it make you look at how you prepare for games? The fact that they can then start a game so slowly when you've had a whole week on the training field. It's really difficult to talk to you. But if I'm 100 honest, I would prefer not to do that. You know why? For all the things you wrote, so if somebody else wants to ask that question, then I answer it. Yeah, and I'll if not, it you ask it. And then I, can you say it again, please? Uh, yeah, just uh, it looks like the team has been starting slowly all season. Well, what's the reason behind that? Do you think? Yeah, that's true. We had that. We had that subject through the through the. Um, um, in the first part of the season, no, not so much. Uh, anymore, but today it was, uh, if you want, uh, the pinnacle of, of our problems because in a game like this, it's it's absolutely not allowed. But um, and I, you can you can um, criticize, you can judge us, you can say whatever you want, and you are probably right. I'm, I'm, I, I have nothing to say against that because these 12 minutes are not allowed. Coming here with all the things we did in the last in the last few um, days. Um, and during the, the whole season so far, what, and what we want, and then you arrive here, and this is the outcome. That's really hard to take, I have to say. So, I don't think we had other we had other games did this with the early with the conceding early goals that we we have that since the last season. So it was now not that much anymore. But when we, we didn't win games, so it's pretty likely that you lose uh, when you lose games that you concede the first one. Um, but again, these 12 minutes were the worst for a while. You, you, sorry, Jürgen, do you think, it, I mean, obviously this was a bad day at the office. Is it more than that, though, given the your form since the end of the since just it's, it's really, it's really, it's really difficult to, to, so, to, to summarize, if you want, because, again, so it, the team is not full of confidence. You can see that first 12 minutes were obvious, but it's about, it was about defending. It was about being compact. It was about being active. Do you need a lot of confidence for that? I, I'm, I'm not so sure. So um, put a body between yourself and the... Uh, between the ball and the opponent, whatever these kind of block the ball, these kind of things, um, avoid the cross. That, that's all. We saw Stefan Bacci obviously full of confidence, so he plays football for 19 or as long as we kept him on the pitch. All the other started a bit different, um, but second half with low confidence level playing this kind of game, I think nobody would have been surprised if we score here that we score once and twice. So and then. Let's have a look at the game. I know it's hypothetical, 100%, but that was possible. So, um, 
we cause the problems ourselves. So how can that happen? We cannot. We cannot. Always, I cannot always cover things with. Um, uh, um, it's a, it's, it was obvious. We do it in public. That's why everybody can see it. Sorry to interrupt. Are you, no problem. Are, are you concerned at this stage? But uh, I can't this question. Unfortunately, uh, some, you ask me that too often. How can right. I? How? No, not you. But in general, how can I not be concerned? I cannot sit here and think, oh no, that's all okay. We did well, but uh, it's football. It's not. Um, and I got now asked a uh, question outside if it's um, uh, because of last season, 63 games, blah, 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 stuff like this. Yes, definitely. We have to, we have to say, meanwhile, it's clear that has had influenced the, the first part of the season. But how long do we want to suffer of that? So how long? So it's now the second part of the season. If, if on my watch, is February. Um, we had a full week to prepare. We have another eight, nine days to prepare the next game. So, and then we are fit, we are now there. That might have been the problem early in the season. Of course, then injuries, all of clear. But for today, this, the first five minutes, that's not allowed. I have to say that. But if we did it anyway, that's true. And um, that's the outcome. So then after that, you can see, this is not a 3-0 like you would say a 3-0 looks. So they say, OK, Wolves were clear better side and um, um, Liverpool had no chance. No, we were, Wolves was a clear better side for 12 minutes and maybe the last 10 when they were 3-0 up and then they could, the ball was then their friend again. But in between, we were really in the game and especially the second half, we put them massively under pressure against a team full of confidence now because being 2-0 up and full of, and had a momentum. So that's what we can do as well. But then we don't finish the situations off, which is not helpful, obviously. And that's why we lost three now. Yeah, you said the players have, have lost a bit of confidence. Have you, have you lost any confidence in them? Do you, they're, they're still top players who've done an awful lot for you, but are you, are you starting to lose your belief in, in certain members of the team or the, the team itself? No, as I, what do we mean with losing confidence? I, I, I don't think they are the best in the moment. And do I like that? No. But I still know that how good they are and how can, can be. But football is not, and life is not like this. You know, we, we are not every day, and it's not because of him, him, him. So these things happen because we, 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 we cannot help ourselves in this moment. And how can you get in a situation? Of course, like seven, eight players had nothing to do with the first goal. The other seven, eight players had nothing to do with the second goal. But anyway, but everybody's influenced by it. So there's, these, are the, these are the situations we have, we have, to, we have to go through. I, I don't lose confidence in the boys or whatever. So, but I see um, well, where we have to improve, and um, that's what we what we are working on. And again, <laughs> it makes this so typical the situation. So it's just, the start is horrible, and then it's normal, and then it's great. But okay, without finishing, I get that. that we, but playing here nil nil like we would have played the whole game, like the, the, the 30 minutes in the second half, would have loved to see then the result. But we, we, at the moment, it's always if if if. So and I cannot hear it anymore. But it's still the situation. Just check Fabinho, was he did, was that an injury with the squad today? Or? He was ill. Yeah. Confidence is such a fragile thing, and we've seen it before in football many times. You would have seen it. I mean, you can shout at them, you can praise them. How do you, how do you turn it around? How do you Not that? in press conferences. <laughs> so that doesn't help, obviously. So that's why. Um, I, I, you know my job, I know my job, and my job is not to explain out here how I can build up my team. I will be judged by, will get judged by that from you, um, and that's fine. Um, but let me say like this, for today, it was not good enough what I did. And you're, do you have confidence in your own ability to turn it around? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Thank okay. Sorry.